Hello and thanks for tuning in. Today I have a character warehouse haul for you. Just got back from Orlando a couple days ago and we hit up the International Drive Character Warehouse and the Vineland Drive Character Warehouse. We got a ton of stuff and I'm so excited to show you all the great goodies that we got from the Character Warehouse. So let's begin. Starting off in clothing. So here is one of the shirts I got. It is a Star Wars May the Force Be With You shirt. This is awesome. I love three quarter sleeve. I'm wearing a three quarter sleeve shirt right now. Love this type of clothing. It was originally $36.99 and I got it for $14.99. So what a great deal for that. Next, I have another shirt here. This is adorable graphic tee here. Don't just fly, soar with Dumbo. This shirt is such a nice soft material. It's like, I wanna lounge in it, but it's not pajamas, it's a regular shirt. It's just really nice. Um, it's $7.99, originally $32.99, so great deal uh, for a shirt like this. A lot of times you'll find those shirts for $7.99 or $9.99. The next item is some pajamas. So these are the pajama pants and they say mini and ahoy and they have anchors and the Disney Cruise Line logo and they come with a matching shirt uh, tank top here with mini and the anchor. I just think that is too stinking cute. So this is a two piece set. Originally $39.95 and I got it for $14. So together that's a great deal for uh, Disney Cruise Line uh, apparel here. And I get to take it on my Disney Cruise. I'm so excited for that. I love nice pajamas. It's like Christmas morning. Do you guys get pajamas for Christmas Eve and you wake up and you're in nice pajamas for Christmas morning? Well, that's what it's going to feel like when I'm on the Disney Cruise. Next is another graphic tee. And here, this one is Mickey, and he is got like the taking your picture pose here. And I just thought this was really necessary for any Disney blogger. I literally said that when I was in the store immediately as I saw it. I was like, all Disney vloggers need to have this t-shirt. It's just too perfect. Originally it was $29.99, and I got it for $9.99. So great deal for this, really cute. Uh, the next is another shirt here, black tank top here. This is incredibly glittery and it has all of Walt Disney World's Park with Epcot, the Magic Kingdom, um, Tower of Terror, and Animal Kingdom. So there is super sparkly. Um, I love all things sparkly and glittery. So <laughs> right up my alley. $7.99 was this shirt, originally $29.99. I'm excited to wear that. Uh, Raphael also got a shirt, moving on to men's clothing. This is just a blue t-shirt with the Disney Cruise Line logo. On the back here, it has a big crab. Ooh, we went out of focus here. Big Crab on board, and uh, this t-shirt was a better deal. It was $6.99, originally $24.99, so great deal on a t-shirt. Moving on, I picked up a lot of gifts. Uh, some gifts for my nieces and nephews, and I'm excited to stock up. I normally will, if I see something and it's cheap, I'm not, and I'm at the character warehouse, I will save it for their birthday or Christmas because, you know, it's great to snatch up these cheap deals when you can, and then you have presents for later on. So these shirts here, can you believe this? I feel like it's insane uh, what I got these for. These are little pirate long sleeve shirts with fall right around the corner, 99 cents. That's right, 99 cents for Disney apparel. What? Crazy. So they're like, kind of sweatshirt material long sleeve and they're like little Jack Sparrow pirate shirts. So I got uh, two of them, one for each of my nephews and it's just a great gift. I also got this Mickey blanket here. This blanket, if you can see right inside, you put your arms through the sleeves here. It's a child fleece blanket. It's kind of like a Snuggie, but you know, I don't think it really, um... do Snuggies zip up? No, they don't, right? 
well, I guess it's like a snuggie, but not. This came from Shanghai, China, and it is $7.99, originally 239 yen. I'll put the conversion up here. I don't know that off the top of my head, but um, eight bucks for a blanket. That's fun. This is a fun blanket to watch movies in. Um, definitely going to uh, one of my nieces or nephews for this one. We got a lot of fun toys. So here we have a little Pandora passport. Uh, this was 99 cents. Uh, originally $16.99 for this. Um, you can even place your photo here. And I believe this is a pin. Oh yeah, uh, passport uh, sticker pages where you put the stickers inside the passport, photo ID badge and a button. You know, this is just fun little play stuff. And for 99 cents, why not? Next, I got more Pirate of the Caribbean toys. So here we have an Elizabeth Swan action figure. This also came from Shanghai. And uh, this is pretty cool because she has a little flame torch. <laughs> and this was 99 cents. So... They had a bunch of Pirates of the Caribbean action figures, and I also couldn't resist a deal for Goofy as well. So Goofy was $1.99, and uh, it's kind of interesting because he has a sword that comes with him. He has these just fun little action figures. We have Minnie Mouse. And we have Donald Duck. So we're missing Mickey. Mickey probably sold out in Shanghai. But with Minnie here, Minnie was 99 cents. And this was um, 65 yen, which is like $12. If I'm wrong, I'll put it up. Uh, something around that, depending on the conversion. But Minnie uh, action figure, 99 cents, awesome. And Donald here, Donald was also 99 cents. So these are fun. I mean, they're a little big to put in like stockings or something, but I uh, these are gonna be really fun just to give out for little fun toys. It's kind of interesting though, how the price difference, uh, Elizabeth Swan was more expensive and Goofy was more expensive than Minnie and Donald. You would think that you know, Minnie would be more expensive than Elizabeth Swan. I don't really know how they came up with that, but hey, I'll take 99 cents. Keeping right along with the pirate theme, we got these little light skull spinners. Is this not the funnest thing ever? I want to keep this for myself. <laughs> this was 85 yen originally and these were 2.99 at the outlet and or at the character warehouse what i intend to do with these is the, give this in one of the fish extenders for the upcoming cruise because just like in the parks on the cruise ship they sell uh light up glow sticks and glow wands lightsabers um so this will be a fun thing that when everyone has pirate night they can take this and bring it on deck and you know bubble blowers as well so they'll have a toy to play with uh before the fireworks another gift here is these adorable mini sneakers check out this little bow on the back that is just too stinking cute but these little kid sneakers here were $4.99, originally $30. So I'm so excited to gift these. I know kids go through sneakers really fast. So when you can pick up a pair for $5, that's a good deal. Really cute. Moving on, we also got a ton of hats. Hats are always great when you're in the parks and your head starts hurting from your ears or it's too hot or I need to put my hair up. I always like to have an option of having a hat as well. So first we have this adorable retro Mickey to stinking cute. Look at the colors on this. It's so perfect for summer. Too bad we're going into fall, but I will definitely be wearing this regardless. And these hats were all on sale and they were all the same price let me see which one has a a price tag on them i will insert the price of the hats right here so the next hat is this black one with mickey on it 1928 mickey mouse just black it'll go with everything that's a nice cap to have and then 
look at this one this is so awesome this is kind of like the retro white one with the neon colors i've seen the shirt that matches this it's really sharp at nighttime so that is awesome i don't know if these will be mine or raphael's because i like these so much that i might just you know keep them all for myself and uh lastly this one will be his raphael's hat this uh blue and red this reminds me of like a jean material but it's really not it's it's, it's a cloth fabric um but it has this design on it walt disney world in the stitching here so great deal for these hats you can't beat it you always go through hats i always go in the pool with my hats and i ruin them so always could use more <laughs> i forgot i have one more hat this hat is a gift star wars hat again there was a lot of star wars merchandise while we were visiting the character warehouses this hat we got for 4.99 great deal for this and it was originally 29.99 so i'm excited to give this hat away i know they're gonna really like it look at that this is you know authentic with its little sticker here so that is fun some photo frames so here we have a disney cruise line frame here originally 16.99 so i'm really excited to use this for fish extenders um this is going to be one of the main gifts that i give not in this upcoming cruise but i'm saving it for an additional fish extender cruise so i don't have that cruise planned yet but because it was a great deal i'm holding on to these for the next time and it is really adorable so it has like anchors and the disney cruise line logo old-fashioned uh looking stamps so that'll be a really nice gift to hold on to next in photo frames i also got this mini photo frame this came all packaged in a big styrofoam box because it is a heavy frame it has a sand to kick out and it was $6.99 originally $22.99 so really pricey I think originally it was pricey because of the weight of it but I think it'll go really awesome on my collection behind me and let me know give this video a thumbs up if you think I should finally uh put some photos in these frames behind me because <laughs> I'm getting more frames and I'm not putting pictures in them so I'm I'm meaning to do that so again, I can't wait to put this one up. Next, I have some mugs. So this is a Germany mug and on the back here, Epcot World Showcase. This mug was originally uh, $13.99 and got it for $3.99. So this is also gonna be a gift, but I'm excited because uh, food and wine is going on right now. So, you know, Epcot is on people's minds and I have a birthday coming up and I know they will like this and next i have another mug this is a tron mug and this was originally 99 yen and i believe this was also through nope 2.99 2.99 for this mug a little bit cheaper but this is the type of mug that has like the lid on top so if you're drinking your tea and you don't want to um make sure it doesn't get cold uh, this I'm going to be saving for a giveaway, so stay tuned. I'm collecting a lot of good items from Character Warehouse and other places for a giveaway, so make sure you subscribe so you know when I have uh, a bunch of stuff for a giveaway. So more household kitchen items. We got some snack clips here for chip clips, uh, a couple different colored ones here. These were originally $7.99 and I don't remember the price off the top of my head, but I will look at the receipt and link it right here. Mickey touch in your kitchen is always necessary. Also, we got a water bottle. It says it's a sure thing with Mickey on it. And over here, Mickey's longboard surf team. This was originally $15.99 and we got it for $3.99. So I have a obsession with water bottles, so I can always use water bottles or gift it away when I my cabinets are too full because I have too many. I can't say no to water bottles. Coffee mugs included. Okay, 
So I'm really excited about this next thing because I already put it in this little gift bag because on the Disney cruise, we are going to be participating in a Christmas ornament exchange. I love the holidays. I'm so excited for this. This is a Sally ornament originally. $30 and I got it for $5.99. So this Sally ornament here is really awesome. I know a lot of people, because it is a uh, Halloween on the high seas cruise, a lot of people will be really uh, into the Nightmare Before Christmas movie and I know this ornament will be a lot of fun. The uh, ornament gift exchange is basically like a white elephant game. Um, if you don't know what that is, it's just kind of a spin-off version of Secret Santa, uh, but you just, you trade ornaments and you walk away with hopefully an ornament that you like so you give one and you receive one that's just something fun so i'm looking forward to giving this away and receiving one as well next i got some jewelry this is a mickey head uh necklace here it's really pretty um it's kind of like well hidden mickey jewelry because it's not like super obvious that it has Mickey on it because these some of these are circles and then some of these are Mickey's. Uh, originally the price I don't know it is one of those color coordinated um, prices. It was originally maroon so I don't know what that means uh, but it was $8.99 and and I just thought this was too pretty to pass up. I know I'll get a good use out of it. Moving on to another fish extender item that I'm saving for another cruise at some point in time. I have these Castaway Key keychains. So these Castaway Key keychains were $2.99 and the original price was purple. So I don't know what that price was, but I know that it was more than $2.99. So a great deal there as well. The back is just plain, it says made in China. Or no, it says Disney Canada, just kidding. <laughs> but this is really fun. I'm definitely gonna be giving this away on a fish extender where the cruise goes to Castaway Key. Moving on, I got some great deals on some pins. So if you watched my walkthrough of the store, you know that early morning they have pins that are 99 cents. So here is a Shanghai Grand opening pin. And this pin here is Daisy on it. It says grand opening, it's a limited release. It was originally 59 yen, and I'm really excited to start my pin collection, to trade some of these off. Here is a mini one, also 99 cents, originally 59 yen, grand opening as well. These are all grand opening ones. And here is Tigger as well, so, I know um, I might keep some. I got a couple extra, keep some, give some away. Pins are really fun, um, especially when they're inexpensive like this to start a collection. And the last that I got was postcards. I love sending and receiving mail. So uh, when I receive mail, I love to send some postcards, whether it's from the park and you can get it stamped if you leave a postcard at the park. But these postcards were really cheap, 99 cents. No, excuse me. These postcards were 49 cents for Mickey and the writing area on that is pretty small here. But, uh, and then the Star Wars one. So if eventually I'll get a P.O. box and you guys can write me and I'll send you back some mail. Well, that does it for my character warehouse haul. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all the goodies that I got from both stores. We really enjoyed taking you with us and shopping during the stores. If you didn't catch those uh, character warehouse walkthroughs, I'm going to be doing some more of those when I go back to Orlando. It's a lot of fun to scope out all the deals and see all the savings that you're getting. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe for more character warehouse walkthroughs, more character warehouse hauls, and other Disney content. I frequent the parks. I love weekend getaways. I travel a lot. I have some Disney cruises coming up. I'm so excited for what the future holds. I hope you'll share it with me. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, guys.